Hi, I'm Dr. Kim Duramo from drkimd.com, mind body medicine physician. And I have a really cool yoga pose that I'm going to teach you today, and it's called broccoli pose. Well, it's sort of called broccoli pose. I learned this from Matt Sanford, who also teaches mind body medicine, but he is on the side of being a patient, and he's transformed his health using mind body medicine when he had a spinal cord injury. He's an incredible, amazing man, and I met him because we were both teaching at a medical conference last weekend, and he told me he teaches this pose to yogis, and he calls it broccoli pose. So this pose is like broccoli for your entire emotional system, your entire well-being. So you want to do it every day as much as you possibly can. There's three tenets to self-healing. One is that the mind and the body are connected. And this is the premise of my whole medical practice is that your mind, all of the thoughts that you have inform everything that's happening in your body. Your thoughts, the ideas, the beliefs, any of the limitations, they can limit your physical health. The second tenet is that the body has the ability to heal itself. So if your body is getting what it needs, it, you know, you have a cut on your finger, it knows how to seal up that cut and how to heal that cut. Your body also has the inner wisdom to reverse diseases like cancer, even something so extreme. So your body does have an inner wisdom and it's up to us as physicians to find what is obstructing that to allow your body to heal. The third tenet is that your structure and your function are related, meaning your physical body, the structure of your body, if you're walking around hunched over like this, it's impossible for you to be happy and have a sense of well-being. You need to open up your chest, hold your shoulders back, relax your, your neck in order to have that sense of confidence and that sense of that uplifted state in your mood. And that's what this yoga pose is all about that we're calling broccoli pose. And I'm going to show you here today. So it's really important that you take this seriously because if you are in a bad mood or you feel depressed or you even anxiety and you address your physical structure by opening up your chest, feeling a sense of well-being, allowing that to start to percolate because of that structural change, you will create changes in your emotions. You'll change your hormones, decreasing stress hormones, increasing the hormones of well-being and the hormones that reverse diseases like cancer. So I'm gonna get on the floor and show you this broccoli pose today. It's a chest opener. And you basically take a bolster or you can roll up a towel or you can put a pillow or whatever. And you put it on the floor. And so pretty much anybody can do this pose because it's really easy. And you sit just at the edge of that and you allow yourself to lie back over that bolster and open up your chest. So you basically, you can bend your knees or keep them straight, but you want to allow this opening in your chest and just lay here for about five minutes so that for a full five minutes, you allow your breath to move through your body with your chest in this open position. So your arms are up and back so that rotates your the humeral head which is the where your arm meets into your shoulder socket it's going to rotate this out and allow this opening of your chest even more fully and you just relax and breathe here for about five minutes now you can do a modified version of this wherever you are if you're at your desk you want to just be mindful of opening your chest holding your shoulders back and letting your chest rise up why this is going to reverse aging in your body, reverse the fatigue and low energy. It'll give you an energy burst in the day. Just inhale and breathe, open your chest and take a few deep breaths to let your chest be open. You cannot, virtually cannot stay in this chest open position after about five minutes and feel depressed and feel sluggish and be creating disease. It's going to initiate the reversal of the disease process. So make sure you eat broccoli every day and do your broccoli pose as often as possible. This is Dr. Kim Doramo from drkimd.com and I will be seeing you soon.